if I had a month to live and the day before I left this earth, I got a chance to do a TED talk of whatever, an hour, however long it would be, what is the most useful, actionable wisdom, perspective, tactics, strategies, whatever about life that I would want to share with people. And I ended up writing a book on that, that I never released. It just became my keynote speech. So the idea of like, what would my TED talk be has has been in my mind for years, but I never really actively pursued it until I, you know, got in touch with someone in the organization. So I'm very excited to do that. I'm incredibly excited as well. Now, the topic is something that's near and dear to our hearts Mm. at Suivera because it's included in our mission. Mm. And there's a song that you wrote as well. Are you allowed to share what the topic is? And this amazing song, like the lyrics, we listened and it's it's incredible. So (laughs) the song is... I want to make it our theme, to be oh, quite honest. To. Thank you. I appreciate yeah. it. Um, so I I wasn't thinking of doing a TED Talk on this topic, but I, earlier in the year, just had an idea to write this song. I have a lot of, um, I guess, uh, how can I say it, o- opinions about things that I, I don't, you know, I'm not a psychologist, but I, I read a lot on psychology. Um, I read a lot on spirituality. Um And I just, I have kind of high level opinions about politics, not about any one politician versus another or any ism or any right or left or anything like that, but just in general, how I believe the world would be a better place. And I've had this thought in my head for a long time that I wanted to articulate in a song, which is the name of the song is Unity. And the name of my talk is going to be something like uh, Build Bridges, Not Barriers, A Call for Unity. And the truth is that people do unite. I mean, we are, humans are absolutely, you know, social creatures, no question from, you know, hundreds of thousands of years ago uh, to now. What happens sometimes, and I think too often, is that people find unity or solidarity and they band together in groups, which is a good thing in general, but the glue that binds them together is not fighting for a cause, fighting for something. It really, the glue that binds them is a mutual hate or a mutual disdain at the very least for other ideologies, groups, people, ideas, whatever it is. And so that, that unity is a good aspect, but there can be a dark side to that. And so I've, I've had these kind of, I don't know, lines in my head that turned into lyrics, which, which like the first line of the song is, can you stand for a cause without bashing your brother? Um, be proud of who you are without being anti-other. I believe you can be proud of your heritage and not be anti any other race or anything else. You can celebrate it. So it's just kind of a call and hopefully, you know, music is is art and it's a way that I hope evokes emotion and I hope it evokes a positive emotion. So I could stand here and tell you my ideas, maybe through story form or whatever, and that might be good. And I will talk a little bit about what I believe, but what I'm really going to say is I hope I've captured this in a song and, you know, this is called Unity. And then I'm going to start playing it um, as, you know, it hasn't been released yet. It'll be out um, uh, the week before I do the TED Talk. So before the end of of, uh, 2024, the song will be released globally. But um, at the very end, I plan on singing the song and having a handful of people walk out on stage and they start singing the first chorus with me. And then more people come out and they start singing along and singing the second chorus. And then more until I have a dozen people just huddled around me at the piano and we're all singing unity and hopefully the audience is too but it won't be a deal killer if it isn't but i just have this this idea in my head of there's just one guy talking about an idea one guy who sits down and starts playing and singing and then it ends with unity right that with all these people joining me and so that's kind of the vision that's in my head about this to to hopefully drive the point home in an artistic way 